Hi, I'm Ian Call, the Technical Director of the Indoor Air Quality Association, bringing you an IAQA tech tip on dust mites. Are you allergic to dust? If so, I have some disturbing news for you. You're not allergic to the dust, but rather the allergens in that dust. One common allergen found in dust is from dust mites. Wait a second, it gets worse. What triggers the allergies in sensitized individuals is predominantly the dust mites feces. Dust mites are in the same class as spiders, although they're very difficult to see because they're less than a millimeter in length. Just because they're out of sight doesn't mean they should be out of mind. Dust mites thrive where there's a steady stream of skin cells and high humidity. Humans can shed a million skin cells a day with a good number of them ending up in the bed. As for humidity, some dust mite species need relative humidities above 73%, whereas other species only need it above 58% at room temperature. A home may be maintaining a good relative humidity of 40% as measured in the middle of the house. However, under the covers and on your pillow, you have perspiration and respiration that can increase the humidity into the range desired by dust mites. Don't get me wrong, it's important to control the home's relative humidity in order to control dust mites. However, you will likely need to use other supplemental strategies such as encasing mattresses and pillows with a specialized fabric and washing bedding in hot water for one hour. Most dust mite feces is relatively large in size, around 20 microns in diameter. Because of its size, it won't stay airborne for long periods of time. Therefore, air filters are not an effective means to address dust mite allergen. You might dismiss the concern about dust mites because surely you don't have a problem in your bed. You might argue that you've never had allergies. Well, you may in fact have a significant amount of dust mites, but don't know it because only sensitized individuals will experience allergic symptoms. To learn more about dust mites and how to sample for them, the IAQA has online classes as part of their IAQA University. For more information, please visit the IAQA website.